EMGS uses 3D electromagnetic methods, which include controlled source electromagnetic and magnetotelluric methods, to measure subsurface resistivity from the seabed. Studies demonstrate that our data significantly increases exploration success rates when integrated with seismic and other information. 3D EM in Action looks at just a few of our 600 surveys. Many Barents Sea traps have turned out to be leaky and bear only residual oil and gas. Our surveys reduce exploration risk by identifying commercial scale reservoirs before drilling. That is why 14 companies used our 3D EM multi-client scanning data. We placed low noise, high sensitivity receivers on the seabed and towed our powerful source above them. All the receivers remained active to record full azimuth 3D data. In these areas, the key question is, do the prospects contain commercial scale hydrocarbons? In this example, 3D inversion of EM data integrated with seismic data clearly shows an anomaly. Several large discoveries have been made in areas where our multi-client data is available, including Statoil Skrugar and Havis Fields. On the other side of the world, Petronas wanted to de-risk seismic prospects. CSEM was once seen as a deep water method, but improved equipment, processing and inversion mean that water depth is now only limited by safe vessel operating conditions. In this example, a high resistivity area coincides with the seismic defined prospect, which increases the confidence in the prospect, and potentially reduces the number of wells to be drilled. In the Gulf of Mexico, focus exploration needed to make a drill or drop decision for a small prospect close to a high resistivity salt body. We placed a 3D receiver grid over the seismic prospect with a calibration line extending over a nearby discovery well. The EM and well resistivity data agree. The data confirms the prospect. A nearby dry hole has no response. And a new, deeper prospect has been identified. Armed with this new information, Focus Exploration has upgraded the original prospect from too risky to a high probability of success and identified a new prospect. In the North Sea, we cooperated with Statoil to assess our latest 3D EM technology in the well-known Troll Western Oil Province. 3D inversion of EM data clearly delineates the reservoir. The dry well falls outside the boundary. And by combining porosity information derived from seismic inversions with water saturation data from EM inversions, we have calculated hydrocarbon saturation volumes for the entire reservoir. These four examples, from scanning to reservoir evaluation, offer a taste of the expanding range of 3D EM applications. We are pioneering the use of our technology for hazard identification, which can make drilling safer and also mapping unconventional resources such as gas hydrates. And we are using magnetotelluric methods to improve understanding of basin geology in areas where salt and volcanics make traditional methods challenging. Whether you are exploring frontier regions, making drill or drop decisions, or monitoring carbon sequestration, ask us how we can help.